I just, it, I mean, there was just something about her I wanted to know about when I first, it was not just beauty, which she's beautiful, you're beautiful, and, but it just something about her, I really want to know her, and it's almost like you don't, can't even control why, you don't know why. But I was determined that, you know, if, if I love this person, I'm going to marry her, you know, I don't care what you guys think, I'll make it work. I've never laughed uh, so much in my life until I met him. And it's, tr it's true. It's very true. That's so bizarre for me to hear because she laughs so much. Yeah. I can't imagine her in any other way. Michael's taught me how to be patient, which is interesting coming from an ADHD kid, because <laughs> I never would have thought patience was one of my virtues, but I think it is. She said, well, putting up with you has taught me what taught me patience. <laughs> Life's such a wonderful thing, it's a matter of even on the baddest days, I still smile because we're still together. Yeah. And we're trying to make each other better in our own unique way. I guess the funniest thing about the wedding was the jacuzzi. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> But, um, <laughs> I can't say that on tape. No, 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 no. So when he came to visit me, we went up to, it was at a Holiday Inn, and they were having wine and cheese, and we hadn't eaten anything else. Too much wine. <laughs> so that's when he proposed. Kelly and I may fight and argue and bicker, but at the end, we love one another. And people today need to know that just because we have a disability, that doesn't mean we can't fall in love and get married and live a normal life. Very well put. Yeah.